Hello and welcome to this video on east-west and north-south network traffic. In this video, we'll be discussing the different types of network traffic and how they affect your network. Before moving forward, let's first understanding network traffic. Network traffic is the amount of data that is transmitted and received by a device on a network. It can be categorized into two types, east-west and north-south. East-west traffic is the data that flows within a data center or between servers in the same location. North-South traffic is the data that flows between the data center and external networks or devices. Now let's understand what is East-West traffic. East-West traffic is usually generated by applications within a data center. For example, when a user accesses a website, the data travels from their device to the data center's servers, where it is processed and sent back to the user's device. In this case, the network traffic is considered East-West because it is flowing within the data center. Let's discuss North-South traffic now. North-South traffic, on the other hand, refers to the data that flows between the data center and external networks or devices. This includes traffic that flows over the internet or between different data centers. An example of North-South traffic is when a user accesses a website from their device, and the data is transmitted over the internet to the data center's servers. Last, we will understand the importance of network traffic. It is essential to monitor network traffic to ensure that your network is functioning correctly. East-West traffic can consume a significant amount of bandwidth, which can slow down other applications running on the same servers. On the other hand, North-South traffic can be a security concern, as it can be used to transmit sensitive data outside of the network. In conclusion, understanding East-West and North-South network traffic is crucial for managing your network's performance and security. Monitoring your network traffic can help you identify potential issues and optimize your network's performance. Thanks for watching. Please hit like and subscribe if you like the content.